I'm meteorologist Adam Stiles. It is feeling more May-like than March-like, but it's going to get back into some March-like weather as we head into the middle part of the week. We have some rain on the way moving in tonight. It'll be here for the morning commute. Right now it's raining to our north, and we'll continue to see this area of low pressure settling in across southern Ontario. And that is going to be not only bringing us the rain, but it'll usher in those cooler temperatures. But mild throughout the evening, you can get outside and enjoy it without having to layer up too much. And then that colder air starts to move in by the afternoon tomorrow. With that rain on the way for the morning, you may want to give yourself just a little bit of extra time. It's not going to be heavy rain, but it'll be consistent. The roads will likely be wet as we watch that rain settling in through the morning hours. And it's right into the thick of it between 7 and 9, which is commute time here in the GTA. Once we bring that front through, 1.30, 2 in the afternoon, the rain is done. The cloud cover will linger. That will actually clear out by the evening. And we'll see that colder northwest wind moving through. And then there's potential for some flurries on Wednesday for some of the areas to the north. So it's a 9-degree start to the day. It is going to be a wet morning. And then through midday, Showers should start to wind down closer to 1 o'clock and then into the afternoon. We'll actually see some sunshine, breezy conditions, and those falling temperatures. In the seven-day, a couple of things to hone in on. Cooler start to Wednesday back below the freezing mark. Three degrees the daytime high on Wednesday. Flurries to the north. We'll hold off on the rain until Thursday evening. Temperatures bouncing back on Thursday. Friday looks wet in the morning and then windy in the afternoon. I think we'll see gusts 60 to 70 kilometers per hour. So some of the windiest weather we've seen in a while. And then the weekend is cool as we'll drop down to about one degree for a daytime high come Sunday. That's a check on your forecast.